Hello, Earthlings. You were late again. Classes started a long time ago. Sit down. <gasps> Look! It's an alien. Who cares? Meet Salmonoid. He's a local humanoid. Kelly loves aliens. Caroline protects nature and doesn't believe in ETs. Professor Plumbum is a new substitute teacher, replacing Mr. Cosine, who mysteriously disappeared. Salmonoid comes to college. Hi, neighbor. Oh, it's just <gasps> Kelly wearing a costume. Kelly keeps a whole file on aliens, and she has a special UFO diary for it. Attach a printed picture of an alien to a notebook cover. Kelly is watching Salmonoid closely. He's staring at Caroline's cute cows. No wonder, these are aliens' favorite victims. Kelly, did you see? My herd vanished. Of course, because Salmonoid is an alien. <laughs> Kelly, don't be stupid. Aliens don't exist. Then why is the new student hiding the cows in his flying saucer? Break time! Salmonoid, take a walk and I'll examine your flying saucer. Make a circle with a cutout section from gray felt. Attach a zipper into the section. Glue the other circle without a zipper. Assemble the two cones to make a flying saucer. Attach a string of lights to the edge in two layers. Hide the battery block inside the pencil case. Glue a clear plastic half sphere on top. How interesting! What is he hiding inside? Is he experimenting on animals? Let's see! Gosh! What do you want? Can't you see I'm busy? I knew it! They exist! Caroline misses her cows. <sighs> Babies, where are you? Hi, Caroline. How are you? Eating her cows was a bad idea. Here, Caroline. Huh? Take this. Cut toy cows in half. Use a heated utility knife. Pour hot glue inside and attach a magnet. These are more Whoa. than just cows. These are locker identifiers. Attach the magnets to the door and you can see right away that it's Caroline's. Salmonoid keeps secrets in his locker. What's that, a teleporter? Kelly watches this weird guy's every move. I'll reveal all your secrets. Oh, there's a whole humanoid museum in here. I knew he was one of them. I'll take a picture of the evidence. What is Salmonoid doing over there? I knew it. He snuck in a cheat sheet under his skin. <gasps> Mr. Plumbum, do you see? This is an alien and he's cheating. Look here. But Professor Plumbum also has something to do with it. Look at his school supply stand. Cover the holes in a mug with a broken handle using polymer clay. Add elongated alien eyes made out of polymer clay. And bake following the package instructions. Color the mug with green acrylic paint. Coat it with acrylic polish. Kelly, do you need a marker? Oh no! Everyone around me is an alien! I knew it! It's an alien conspiracy! Don't touch me! Phew! It was just a dream! Where's my evidence? The aliens deleted it! No, I just turned the pictures over! They are watching me! I 
can feel it! Professor Plumbum! Kelly! Look right here! You are about to forget everything! Kelly wants to catch the humanoid red-handed! She made a bag that Salmonoid will definitely like! Let's see what he'll do! Cut two alien heads from a green plastic folder with some extra along the edges. Cut the edge in a zigzag. Bend the pieces. Glue a zipper into a plastic strip. Hot glue the side of the bag to the strip with the zipper. Glue a handle made from webbing to the edges. Add a bottom and the other side. Glue on black foam paper eyes and edging. Oh, my brother! What did they do to you? I'll bring you back to life! Clear! Come on, bro! Come to life! Ah! Oh no! like to go to the blackboard. Caroline, <sighs> come up! Unfortunately, Caroline doesn't know the answers. <laughs> Psst, buddy, help me out! Easy! Salmonoid takes his special space device. Take a plug out of a marker. Use nail polish remover to wipe labels off the marker. Put a laser pointer inside. Decorate the marker with foil tape. Cover the flashlight with black electrical tape. Define the cap with black acrylic paint. Add a detail made from green metallic paper. Salmonoid quickly burns correct answers on the blackboard with his laser sword. Alien technology! Impressive! Thanks, Salmonoid! You saved me! But not for long! The classmate is already making plans for invading the planet! Phew! I'm so thirsty! Salmonoid, I'll take your cup of Coke! Cut a ring from silver foam paper. Glue a clear cup lid into it. Make circles from metallic paper using a hole puncher. Glue them to the ring. Shape an alien head from air dry clay around a straw. Add a ray on a cup with a glow in the dark paint. Attach a picture of a cow to the bottom. Pour in a drink in the cup. Put in the straw and put on the cap. Salmonoid doesn't like sharing his drink. What's wrong with this cup? It's weird. Hey, what's wrong with you? Gosh! Caroline, what happened? Nothing. I need to leave. <laughs> Kelly started an anti-humanoid group. We even have ID badges. Shade the back of a picture of an alien with a pencil. Place it on white foam paper. Trace the outline of the picture. Color it with acrylic paint. Cut out. Glue a brooch pin to the back. Coat with acrylic polish. Make a few alien pins. Now you believe that aliens exist! Swear on our humanoid handbook! Oh no! It's them again! Please don't erase our memory! Too late! Thanks for cooperating! I'll hand over the secret files to UFO management! See you next time!
Did you like our humanoid at college? Then comment below if any of your friends are aliens and how you'd impress them. Would you make a flying saucer pencil case, a humanoid handbag, or a school supply stand? And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell so you don't miss new UFO ideas from Troom Troom.